invest we had criminal investigations where children were being rented by cartels to post out of the family unit. Once they get released, they said get back to back to back to Mexico and re-rent it again. It happened. No one celebrated more of this presidency than the criminal cartels of Mexico. They're back in business. That's why I said they're facilitating cross they're facilitating crime on the border because cartels are making millions of dollars a day. And I'm sick of them saying they're being humane. When you bring, when you send enticements out that puts the most vulnerable people in the arms of criminal cartels, it's dangerous. To say the Trump administration, shame on them for separating 2,500 families because of parents being prosecuted. You and a citizen families get, get separated every day by sheriffs who arrest a U.S. citizen parent who commits a crime with his child. They get separated. This administration has already caused 17,000 family separations by parents putting their children in, in the hands of criminal cartels. That's what's happening. And the reason I get so I get so emotional about this, whether I'm testifying from a Congress or on TV, is because I've seen the results. I've talked to women who were who were raped over 20 times making that journey. I've held dead children in my arm. This administration, I said it when they announced it, the death's gonna come. You're gonna see more rapes, you're gonna see more death. Because you entice the vulnerable population, they're going to come. That's why this administration needs to go back to at least turn on the Remain in Mexico program. They'll still get their hearings, but they're not going to put themselves in the hands of criminal cartels. There's nothing humane about that. I've seen what these cartels can do. If they can't pay their smuggling fee, they will be tortured. Ice Storm, Phoenix, Arizona, can't pay a smuggling fee. They say, we'll get Chicago, 10000 Once they get to the stash house, they call the family, 20000 We can't afford it. They will call the family and torture that alien and let, let the family listen to him because they couldn't pay their smuggling fees. If they couldn't pay it, they'd kill him. And they did. Criminal cartels have been empowered by this administration. People are going to die. That's the problem. This, and I've seen it. I've seen it. I've investigated it. It's a fact. That's what the danger is here. It's a, not only on a lawless border, people will die. And only the bad guys are going to win. Pete Sessions.